You're about to watch a live stream from our Facebook group. It's a club where we pretty much just talk about board games all day long. Usually I'll live stream at least once a day and everyone's invited. It's free, obviously. So if you're interested in coming to hang out with us, click the link in the description below. Hope to see you there. Okay, so update on the uh, 3D printing of the Santorini box. I uh, got up uh, bright and early, over, jumped over to the library at 10 a.m. when they open, and it turns out that uh, the, the box that I left printing last night, uh, it didn't finish before they had to close, so they had to pause the printing and then just start over, because I guess you can't just pick it back up. So this is what I was left with. So it looks like it got mostly done, this box, See, it says, I'm trying to get decent lighting, level two, because these are the level two pieces in Santorini. And um, trying to find some lighting that isn't terrible. But if you want to take a look at the quality, there's kind of like a, like a little bottom piece that looks like it needs to come off. It's interesting. Yeah, let me just flip this around so it's not all stupid. So, so this looks fine. Of course, it's reversed right now, but... If you look close, oh, I'm really bad at this, and it's not in focus, but it's kind of uh, it's kind of stringy. You see, there's like strings I'm pulling off of it. Why is this reversed? Hold on, sorry, that is annoying. There we go. Okay, so if you look close, you see how it's kind of like not solid here. There's like a little pattern in here. And then it has this kind of scratchy kind of thing because it gets laid down in strings. And then on the bottom here, I think this is almost like a little layer that you're supposed to peel off. At first I thought this, I'm like, what is this? This is very poor quality. But I think you're supposed to just pull this off, maybe. Uh, actually, I'm not sure. I don't know. We're going to have to check with our resident expert, Ben Silver, on 3D printing. But, um, yeah, because if this is just falling apart, that's not good. But I think sometimes they have these kind of things you're supposed to pull them off. Like here, there's like a little piece. That I think you're just kind of supposed to pull these pieces off. It's just kind of like a little extra that uh, 3D printers sometimes do. Like they need to do for structural purposes, I think. So anyway, uh, see, this, I mean, this it looks fine, but apparently it's not tall enough. I would probably have been fine with just keeping it like this, but they just reprinted it on their own. So I'm just gonna get another one in a few hours, I suppose, and uh, and that'll be that. I'll let you guys know how it goes.